welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to do a little uh, quick tutorial here on how to do a black winged eyeliner because I posted a photo on Instagram the other day and I got a ton of questions about how I did this look. So I'm going to show you, hopefully it goes smoothly. I feel like every time I try to do black eyeliner on camera, I just like, you know, I look like an amateur, but whatevs, we will do it. I actually am kind of like an amateur. I'm not like amazing at slaying a wing, like just like the first round out of the gate or something. I, I There's like a lot of tweaking that's involved in me, like figuring out how to like get the wing perfectly sharp. But basically anyone can do this. I already have like my foundation, which I use the Neutrogena Hydro Boost and primer. And I set it with this Hourglass Veil translucent setting powder. So that's what's on my face right now. So the first thing I'm doing is taking some tape though. I don't even know what kind of tape this is. It's like surgical tape. I only slant it upwards. Follow like the line of your lower lash line, but slant upwards. And I just do that on both sides. And this just makes it really easy because I'm pretty sloppy with black eyeliner actually. If any of you watched my previous cat eye tutorial, you already know that. And you just wanna use a tape that's not gonna be like super sticky because you don't wanna like, you don't wanna like mess your eye up, you know? You don't wanna throw the baby out with the bath water. This is actually the Revlon of, or the L'Oreal Infallible Black Gel Eyeliner. I have used the Maybelline Black Gel Eyeliner for as long as I can remember, but they were actually out at CVS. So I did wind up purchasing a different type of gel eyeliner, which was a risk. But actually, this works really well too. And this is my favorite way to apply eyeliner, just with a gel eyeliner and an angled brush. This brush is not clean, but it's okay. It doesn't need to be like super, super clean. So then I always just wipe my brush off. Like make sure you get the excess black off by doing that. I'm gonna draw like a diagonal line from like the end of where you want the wing to end to like the middle of your eye and like don't overthink it. Just draw like a straight diagonal line. And then once you get in like towards the inner half of the eye, basically just line your lash like as close to the lash line as possible. And then just go around and like deepen the black, you know, fix like where you, if you missed any areas, fill them in. So this is what it looks like now. As you can see, it's not like perfect, perfect. And the end is choppy, but when we rip that tape off, it'll be super sharp. So yeah, you just want to make sure to Make sure it's really filled in, like right by the tape, you know. Let's do the other eye now. The as you can see, this one is like went on a lot choppier. That's just how it is, you know, like I'm gonna clean it up. So what I do now is just rip this off. Well, that was a graphic, you don't need to rip it off. But just go ahead and take it off. And then what I do to perfect it is I just put a little bit of concealer on my hand and then I take a brush, a teeny tiny concealer brush. I like this one from Luxie Brushes. I like to I actually like to drag this out, this end out just a little bit more. So I really like tweak with concealer. That's really how I um, get my shit the way I want it. See, I just messed the end up. Now it's not as sharp, but it's okay because then I take a little bit of concealer because it needed to be a little bit longer. And voila, sharp as a bitch. Now I need to do the same with the other side, which is always annoying because, you know, once you get one side perfect, you know for sure you can't get both perfect. So it's just one of the flaws of life, you know? By the way, I don't know if this lighting, this is a different setup because I'm in my makeup room now. I used to have like a wall right behind me and now I have the window behind me and you know, like sometimes that can mess up the lighting. But as far as I can see on camera, the lighting is decent. So hopefully it, it actually is. Now the tails are pretty even, but I need to sharpen the lid. So on top, make sure you're not taking too much concealer, but just drag it along the top. It's pretty good actually. So that's how I do it. And then I always take a little bit of liner across the bottom too, just use whatever's left on my brush. And then I'm gonna go in with a brush, this kind of brush maybe, and blur it out. 
And you just wanna make sure that this is all in one line, you know? As you can see, I put lashes on and did everything else that I needed to do, highlighter and whatnot. So I do have a video on how I apply my lashes too, which I will link below. This is how I do my eyeliner. I hope this tutorial was helpful. Please subscribe if you'd like to see more videos like this in the future. Also check out my collagen peptide serum that is currently for sale on Amazon. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.